with the Wildcats will feature our reigning WAFB High School Football Player of the Week. The Wildcats of St. James are known for their speed and lightning quick scoring strikes. Just that historically their lightning hasn't usually come from the sky. Wide receiver Davin Dennis lit up the E.D. White secondary Friday night for not one, not two, but three scoring strikes of over 50 yards in less than a half of football. When people talk about St. James, they think about running, 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 running the tank. And we just, this year we're trying to change that. On the night, Dennis was a menacing figure for the Cardinals defense, racking up a whopping 265 yards on seven receptions and the three scores. And there's probably no one prouder than his big brother, Harold Dennis, who starred for St. James in the 80s. He's your biggest fan and biggest critic? Yeah. He tells me everything I do wrong and right. If he does something wrong, he knows about it. We know about it because he'll come tell us about it, too. You know, so we, we've, we've come a long way, and I think he's just a junior. So we've got another year if we can get a quarterback and throw it to him. Regions branch manager Cindy Martin may be a fan of rival Lutcher, but she's still proud to present Davin Dennis this week's trophy as our WAFE High School Player of the Week. Funny thing, David missed some practice today accepting that. I hope the uh, Lutcher folks are uh, not thinking that we purposely gave them an advantage going into the game. Well, finally tonight it was uh, media day for the 1999-2000 Jaguar basketball team.